Hey, what's happening this morning, my friends? Hmm? Wow. It's the morning after, huh? Really? Well, we had some nasty storms coming through here last night. And uh, yesterday afternoon even, too. Wow. And it's not too... Uh, my uh, yard and everything didn't get too beat up, but thank God for that. So anyway, nice morning. It is, uh, it's is—it's cloudy, though. It's cloudy. i got to clean this deck off. It's got branches on it and leaves and <coughs> kind of a mess there. But, uh, yeah, it looks like a, a decent day in the works um, later on as it uh, warms up a little bit. Right now it is uh, 64 degrees here on the old north coast of the USA. And uh, this morning, my friends, uh, I'm going to share with you from uh, Jesus Calling on this. Let me get the date right on this Friday, July 21st. <laughs> you think I could get the date right, huh? Uh, Anyway, here we go. Jesus calling for you. Rest in my presence when you need refreshment. Resting is not necessarily idleness, as people often perceive it. When you relax in my company, you are demonstrating trust in me. Trust is a rich word, laden with meaning and direction for your life. I want you to lean on, trust, and be confident in me. When you lean on me for support, I delight in your trusting confidence. Many people turn away from me when they are exhausted. They associate me with duty and diligence. So they try to hide from my presence when they need a break from work. How this saddens me. As I spoke through my prophet Isaiah, in returning to me and resting in me, you shall be saved in quietness and trust shall be your strength. Something to consider today. That's Jesus calling. Something to consider. Uh, rest in the presence of Jesus. Always. You know, when you're exhausted or, or whatever, um, don't turn away. Uh, don't, you know, don't act like there's duty and diligence. That's where you want it. That's where you want to turn. In times of, uh, you know, when you're just wore out and whipped and everything, turn to Jesus and Thank him for your abundant blessings anyway, you know, at least thank him. Start off with a prayer of thanksgiving and uh, and <laughs> know his presence with you all the time. Okay, do that. All right, let's go enjoy this day, my friends. Uh, pray for each other. Let us definitely uh, pray for each other today. Uh, pray for the world. Pray for our country. We need to do that every single day. Of course, know that God loves you. And so do I.